Imagine the shockwaves across the auto industry when a CEO steps on stage and confirms that their most secretive, most talked about engine isn't just a rumor, it's real. That is exactly what Mercedes has done. The company has finally revealed that the Yasa Flux engine exists. An engine once whispered about in hushed tones is now front and center. And this isn't just any motor. Early reports claim it's so powerful and so radically different that giants like Tesla, BYD, and Toyota could soon be losing sleep. If this engine makes its way into production cars, the entire game, petrol, diesel, and even today's electric batteries could be flipped on its head. But the big question remains. What makes this engine so special? Is it truly the game changer the industry has been waiting for? Or is it just another flashy promise destined to fade away? And if it really delivers? Could Tesla's EV dominance finally be under threat? One thing is certain. Revolutions in car tech don't just appear overnight. They are born from years of research, hidden experiments, and carefully guarded strategies. The Yasa Flux engine is no different. Many assume it surfaced suddenly. But in reality, Mercedes has been quietly working on it for years out of the spotlight, with no grand claims and no hype. Just relentless work behind the scenes. That silence was all part of Mercedes' master plan. Let's rewind. Between 2010 and 2015, the EV wave exploded. And Tesla proved with its early models that electric cars weren't just the future. They were already here. Mercedes, watching closely, knew one thing. If they wanted to stay relevant, betting only on batteries wasn't enough. They had to reinvent the motor itself. That's when their eyes landed on a small but brilliant British company. Yasa. This startup was already experimenting with axial flux motors, and their early prototypes hinted at a technology that could completely reshape the industry. Mercedes saw the potential, stepped in with support, and by 2019, took full control of Yasa. That move laid the foundation for what is now being called one of the most disruptive engines in modern automotive history. From the outside, it looked like a simple business deal. But in reality, it was the moment the Yasa Flux engine began. Mercedes poured millions into the project, gave Yasa full funding, and put hundreds of engineers to work day and night. Over the past decade, this quiet partnership transformed into one of Mercedes' boldest innovations. The company kept the project so secret that even industry experts had no clue. People assumed Mercedes was focused solely on luxury EVs. But behind closed doors, they were building an engine that could shift the direction of the auto industry. The second factor in this master plan was timing. Mercedes never rushed to launch the technology. They knew that if they released an incomplete or weak product, companies like Tesla or BYD would ridicule it immediately. So they tested it thoroughly, thousands of hours of simulations and experiments in every condition, until they were fully confident. Only then did they announce it to the world. This move showed how much Mercedes learned from Tesla. Tesla enters the market with noise. Mercedes stayed silent, waited for the right moment, and then struck. This was their master plan. Say less, do more. So, what is the Yasa Flux engine? Think about it. When we talk about cars, the first thing that comes to mind is the engine. Once, petrol and diesel ruled the roads. Then the era of electric cars took over. But today, the name-making headlines is the Yasa Flux engine. Mercedes has revealed it, and discussions are spreading across the world. But what exactly is this engine, and why is it considered so special? Let's break it down simply. Yasa is a British company that originally developed the axial flux motor technology before Mercedes acquired it. Flux refers to magnetic flow. Electric motors work on the interaction between electricity and magnets. Normal electric motors, permanent magnet or induction motors are thick and bulky. They take up a lot of space and weigh much more. But the magic of the Yasa Flux engine is that it's very small, lightweight, and extremely powerful. Its design is called axial flux. What does that mean? In simple words, a normal motor rotates like a cylinder. An axial flux motor rotates like a flat disc. Instead of being a thick cylinder, this motor is like a thin round plate. The question now is, where will Mercedes use this engine first? From what we know so far, the Yasa Flux engine will initially be installed only in luxury and high-performance cars. The biggest reason is cost. Being a new technology, its production cost is high. Companies prefer installing expensive components in vehicles, where the price is already high. But this doesn't mean it will always remain expensive. So now we reach the most important point, what happens next? Because Mercedes has revealed the Yasa Flux engine, but they haven't shown their full hand. This is just the beginning. Over the coming months, Mercedes is expected to reveal performance benchmarks, 
Announce which models will get the engine first. Demonstrate real-world testing. Share details about battery pairing and drivetrain. And most importantly, reveal the production timeline. This is where the entire auto world is holding its breath. Remember, Tesla shook the industry by proving that electric motors could outperform petrol engines. Now Mercedes is trying to shake the EV industry itself. If the Yasaflux engine truly delivers, EVs could become lighter, cars could offer higher torque than ever before, ranges could improve without increasing battery size, motorsport could become even faster, and luxury EVs could reach a level that competitors can't match. But success isn't guaranteed. To win, Mercedes must solve three major challenges. 1. Mass production at scale. Building one flux motor for testing is easy. Building hundreds of thousands a year without quality issues is a completely different challenge. Most new motor technologies fail right here. 2. Cost reduction. Right now, the axial flux design is expensive, especially the magnets. Unless Mercedes pushes the cost down with better manufacturing, the engine will remain exclusive to high-end cars. That limits its impact. 3. Supply chain stability. Rare earth magnets are dominated by a few countries. If their supply decreases or prices rise, production freezes. Mercedes will need to secure long-term partnerships or develop recycling strategies. And now we reach the biggest unspoken truth of the industry. Innovation doesn't matter if customers don't feel the difference. People don't buy a car because the motor is axial flux or radial flux. They buy it because it accelerates better, feels lighter, drives smoother, gives more range, and offers something unique. This is where the Yasa Flux engine could shine. If it actually makes cars more fun, more powerful, and more efficient, then Mercedes will have created a true breakthrough. But if customers don't feel a big difference, the technology may fade away just like dozens of promising motors before it. So, will it succeed? The truth is, this is the most ambitious leap in motor technology since Tesla popularized permanent magnet motors. Mercedes has played their cards carefully. They kept the project secret. They developed the tech quietly for years. They waited for the perfect time, and now they presented a motor that could shift global trends. If this engine works as advertised, Mercedes won't just challenge Tesla, they'll challenge the entire direction of the EV industry. Because while everyone else is improving existing motors, Mercedes is trying to replace the concept of the motor itself. Not an upgrade, not an improvement, a full shift in design. And that's why the world is watching. For now, the Yasa Flux engine is a promise, a big, bold, risky promise. The coming months will decide, is this the next revolution? Or is it another overhyped idea that will quietly disappear? History will judge, and the automotive world is waiting.